Natasha and I'm sitting on my floor right now and my bed is my backdrop and you know it's just been one of those weeks I have finals next week and you're just gonna have to bear with me through this video but today we are actually going to be doing something really fun and if I can find my things and get my mental health in shape this is already starting off bad Okay, so what we are doing today is I am showing you how to make some cool DIY phone cases like these two that I'm showing you right in my hands and this one that's on my phone right now and they're super fun and super easy and super cool to do. So let's just hop into our phone case DIYs. <sighs> just going to need three different colors or four or five or six how many different colors you want but I picked four for this DIY I used blue because I love blue and that's how I'm going to do this phone case but anyways you've probably seen those tumbler things where they're like paint swatches that's kind of my idea for this DIY so I actually did it wrong look at me it's supposed to go on the inside but I started doing it on the outside so you're just going to start painting across with the lightest color first and end up with the darkest color on the top okay so for this next one it's super easy and it's gonna end up something like this but I did this one earlier just to test it out because I had never seen it and I'm going to do pastel colors for this new one anyways so what you're gonna do is you're going to take a little bit of water in a cup and you're going to take a q-tip and dip it in the water before you start dipping it in the paint and then with any paint color you want, you're just gonna start dabbing it on the inside of the case and make sure it's on the inside because if it's on the outside, it could possibly chip. And then you just keep dabbing your little paint away. Once you finish dabbing, or at least you get enough paint on your case as you want, just start blowing at the very bottom of your case or just tilt your case upside down so the paint starts moving to the top of the case and it makes a really really cool little transformation thing with a little like stream like a river we rivers and just keep adding more colors till it makes super cool rainbow looking color things yay for words so for this third one you're going to need three different colors of washi tape i suggest getting two of solid colors and then one accent color like you would with your nails and then you're just going to start applying it. I'll make sure to put a link of a diorama on how to do it because I actually found this on Pinterest and I thought it was super cool so I decided to show you guys. And you're just going to continue going in a little V-shaped form all the way down with all of your colors. And it's tedious, it takes time, but it's fun. And honestly, if it's not perfect on the sides, it's no big deal because it's your phone case unless you're going to sell them. Then you probably want to be very, very tedious and precarious where you push your tape. But at the end of it, you're just going to keep going and 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 going until you have completely finished. And then you realize that, hey, I taped over where the camera hole is supposed to be. Well, then you can just go back with either a knife or something and just poke the hole through. I just tore it a little and then taped it to the back of it. Anyways, I really like the way this turned out and it's super cute and colorful for spring. So yeah, there's your three happy phone case DIY little thingy-majigs. I really hope you like it. And we're back! I really hope you guys enjoyed that. Make sure to give it a big thumbs up if you did and comment down below if you are going to be using this DIY in the future. I really like mine. I've been needing a new phone case, so yay. And it's super easy to buy, just a little FYI heads up thingy. I bought these cases on eBay. They were 87 cents. They shipped from China, free shipping. Let me tell you, that's the best thing in the world. And they're really easy. You can do anything with these cases, really. By the way, my hair looks so on point today. It's kind of curly, and I, I just wanted to show you. Yay for, for messy curly hair. <laughs> I'm super awkward. It's okay, I'm hyper today. I just had some sugar. Anyways, that is the end of the video, so make sure to follow me on my Instagram and Twitter to get notifications from me, and make sure to follow my Snapchat. This is my... This is my little username, my link username right here. Yeah, I'm just gonna wait for you to, uh, to like take that down or take a screenshot or something so you guys can uh, go follow me on Snapchat and see all the cool things I do behind the scenes that you don't see on Instagrams and the Twitters and here. And come to me, go follow me. Come be a part of our family on Instagram and Twitter. We love each other, we really do. We just hugs. Don't forget to subscribe so you can see new videos every single Wednesday. I love you guys so much. <gasps>
hollaback girl. There ain't no hollaback girl. Ow. God. Okay. That hurt. <sighs> I'm a mess.